All right, well today is apparently National Puzzle Day. I didn't know that was a thing, but I had a comment from someone saying that I should do uh, start with Solve for National Puzzle Day. Uh, and so I'm actually gonna look at the Dordal, Cordal, and Octordal, because I also heard from some people that today's Cordal especially was interesting. Uh, we're gonna start with Solve, as suggested by someone for National Puzzle Day. So, okay, so interesting, there's an E. It's not at the end. Um, let's do, let's see, we want to reuse the E in a new spot, otherwise some new letters would be good. Let's do, how about great? That seems like a, a great second guess. Okay, we found the E, so probably S-T-E, something, ooh, it could be steer with a double E, ooh, that would be interesting. Okay, and we haven't found the E over here, so maybe we should, oh no, we did, we've got the E, yeah, 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 there could be a second E, but we've got the E. Um, hmm, so, if it's S-T-E, I don't think it's gonna be, oh, it could be Stern, couldn't it? Oh, that's pretty good, too. Okay, well, the T isn't gonna be fourth, because it would have to be E-T-R, which isn't gonna work. So the T is gonna be second. So Stern or Steer. Um... And we need a we need another vowel on the right probably. There could be a second E. But otherwise there's probably an I or a U. Let's do let's do thine, which will check for an I. It'll check for an N for possibly stern over here. New spot for that T. Check for an H. Ooh, okay. So that was good. Interesting. There's no Ooh, there's an H, but it's not after the T. So ooh, tithe is really good. Tithe is really good. There's no N over here, so it's not gonna be stern. I think it's gonna be steer with two E's. Let's go with tithe, okay? And then steer with a double E. Oh, all right, interesting. So tithe and steer, all right. Well, let's move on to the chordal. I don't know if that's gonna be a good start or not, but uh, I guess we'll see. All right, tithe and steer. I'm hoping for uh, some T's because we're gonna check three spots for T's and three spots for E's as well, yeah. So, um, oh, interesting, two of them do have a double T. Okay, and this one has two E's, but they're not right there. Oh, one's at the end, right, right, right. So, probably E, something R-E maybe, something like that. I don't know, uh, this up here has two T, oh, uh, state is pretty good there. I mean, it has to be S-T something T-E, so, I think state, yep, state, and this has Two T's and an A and an S, but it's not state. T A uh tasty? Okay. And this has an A and a Y. Wow, okay. These are working out really well together. Uh I mean it could be something like fancy. Um it's not too bad. Let's go with fancy. Oh, it's not fancy. Okay. C A Well it's not canny. <laughs> uh campy. Ooh, it could be campy. All right, let's look at the top up here. We don't have much up here. We not, we've got the double E and the R, but could it be R E E S re something re 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 what redo? No, redo is D O. Um. Otherwise, I mean, I'm thinking. Not E at the beginning, but it could be E at the beginning. Otherwise, E second. Something like this, or... Um, oh, it could be, it could be review. Not review like you view it again, but review like, uh, like a play, a review. Um, musical review, that kind of thing. Hmm, I don't know. That would be good. Otherwise... Merge. Ooh, merge is good too. Alright, um, I'm thinking about doing campy, um, which we'll check for the M for possibly merge. It's M and P are both new letters. I don't know, let's just try that. It's not campy. Alright, well it's like this. Um, wacky. Wacky. I think it's almost got to be CK, right? After the C there. And then it can't be tacky. I think it's got to be wacky, probably. 
Yeah, let's go with wacky. Okay, it's wacky. Um, we still don't know... What's going on up here? We've got nothing. Um, so it could still be review. Uh, I think that's pretty good. Let's go with review. Oh, it's not review. Okay, it's E at the beginning. E... E-R, and we've got to have an O, maybe? Erode. Erode. Let's go with erode. Oh, okay. Erode. Wow. All right, cutting a little closer. All right, we're going to move on to the Octortal. We're going to do erode, state, wacky, and tasty. All right, on to the Octortal. Erode, state, wacky, and tasty. So, ooh, didn't get very much on some of these. Now, this one in here looks like it has a lot. Uh, we've got R, O, S, okay, we've got all the, all the letters, so I think it's going to be roast, probably. Yeah, the T has to be at the end. Uh, obviously the A is third. The S has to be second or fourth. Yeah, it's got to be roast. Okay, good. Roast. Um, this is interesting. So we've done E, O, and A. We haven't done I or U. So, uh, this could be fruit. Fruit would be interesting there. That's pretty good. It checks three new letters, if nothing else. Let's go with fruit. Ah, oh, it's not fruit. Ah. Okay. Uh, it's gotta be like that, or the I is at the beginning, but there'd have to be another vowel in there. Um, something, oh, print, print would work. I haven't done an N. Okay, I'm thinking print, but let's come back to that. Uh, we do have a U and an I, okay, so this is probably guide. Okay, good. Um, got a G here, so this is T, ooh, there's a Y not at the end. It's not gonna be I-Y, probably, but is it gonna be I, uh, tying? Tying would be good there. And that checks for the N that we wanted to do for print, so, okay. Yep, and so this is gonna be something rent, it's not print or, <laughs> it's gotta be print, okay. Good. Now this has R, O, I, and G. The R is not at the beginning. The G isn't at the beginning or the end. Uh, this could be Vigor. I think Vigor's really good there. Let's try that. Okay, good. Um, it, it couldn't be Rigor, by the way. Some people might think, oh, it could have been Rigor, but we had the yellow R at the beginning, so it couldn't be Rigor. Um, let's adjust the screen over there before we forget. All right, so, um, now if we do this last one, we won't have to adjust the screen again, but I don't know if we know what that one is, so. Uh, the A, okay, okay, it's not gonna be A-E, probably. So the A is probably at the beginning. So, it could be Apple. Ooh, Apple's really good. Am I confident enough to guess it, though, is the question. Let's look over here. So this is I-N-G, and we have a C. It could be icing. What else could that be? It could also be Ching or Kling. Ooh, okay. Well, if we do Apple, that'll check for the L. This one here, we've got the R at the end, probably E-R. We've got the I and the N. Ooh, the I is at the beginning. Inner. Inner is really good there. Can't be inter or infer. All right, I think it has to be inner. Let's go with inner. Okay, it's inner. And I think apple over here. Ooh, the other one is this is icing. This is icing. We got the we got the eye at the beginning. Yeah, icing. Okay, and then we've got to adjust the screen for our last guess here. Um, I think it's apple. Oh, it could also be ample. All right, we've got a 50-50 for our last one. Um, unfortunately, fruit was our one extra guess that wasn't an answer. So we've, we're down to a 50-50 here. Uh, is there anything? We haven't done an M, and the only P we've done is in print. Well, Apple was the first one I thought of, so I'm gonna go with my first instinct. 50-50. Oh, it was Apple! Alright, cool. 
Well, it could have easily been ample instead of apple, so uh, definitely a little bit of luck there, but it often comes down to a 50-50 on your last guess on the octordal, especially when you start with the chordal words and you just don't have enough information, so. Anyways, there you go. That was the Dordal, Chordal, and Octordal on National Puzzle Day. So let me know what puzzles you're solving today to celebrate and how you did with these Dordal, Chordal, and Octordal and which word you had the most difficulty with and if there was another, you know, word I should have tried that I didn't. And be sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you again soon with some more puzzles. Got a rotten string of bad luck ahead of me now. That is if you believe in any of these various superstitions. Oh, okay. Well, that was really good on the left. Awesome. Ballet over here. Okay, it is L and T, just like I was thinking. Now, alf alphabet. Alphabet. There we go. That's a good one.